So I started off by applying a white base to my eyelid because I really want those colors to pop and I used NYX's Jumbo Pencil and Milk and I am sick right now so I apologize if I sound a little funny. And I just applied that to my eyelid and blended that upward. Then for my transition color, I am using Sigma's eyeshadow and catch and I've been using this pretty much every single time I do my makeup because I just think it goes with everything. And I'm applying that with my Sigma E40 blending brush just above my crease. And then I'm going to take this new Tarte CC Matte Palette, which I think I am kind of in love with so far. And I'm going to use the pink, pinkish color and it's called Pink Outside the Box and I'm going to apply that with a flat brush to my eyelid only. And then I'm going to take the purple color from the same palette and it's called Two Plums Up and I'm going to apply that with my Sigma E30, E25 sorry, um, blending brush and just to the outer corners of my eyes and then I'm going to blend that out in circular motions. And then there's a really dark matte black eyeshadow in this palette and I'm going to take that and I'm going to put it with the same E25 blending brush in the corner of my eye just to give it a little bit of depth. And then taking the lightest color from the palette, I'm, which is called Stand Out from the Crowd, which I think might be my favorite color in this palette, and I'm going to apply that to the inner corner of my eyes. Then I'm going to take the same purple color from that palette, I'm going to run it along my lower lash line, pretty close to the lash line, and I don't want to go too far down, and then I'm going to take my Sigma E40 pencil brush and blend that color out. And then I'm just going to take a gel black eyeliner and run it close, pretty close to my lash line as possible. And it doesn't have to be perfect because then you're going to go over it with um, the black color from that eyeshadow palette and just press that on top and blend it out. And for my brow bone highlight, I used the lightest color from the palette and I will have all the products listed in the description box below.